Hey friends, I'm Jennifer. I'm David. And we have a store in North Alabama called David Christopher's. We have a wholesale store and a retail store. And David is always showing us cool ways to do different things. And we, as you see behind us, have a tree that looks like it has some flocking in it. So in today's video, he's going to show you how to achieve this look. If you have just a solid green tree, how you can make it look like it's a flock tree, right? Correct. And just to give you a sneak peek on prices, this cake that you're looking at right behind me, on our website is for sale for $1.99. So this is a cheap way to make your tree look expensive and beautiful. We're going to talk about tree choices for a minute. Uh, one thing you have to decide when you're choosing a tree is to get a green tree or a flocked tree. And we're gonna help you with that choice right now because um, there are really three choices, not just green or flocked. And there's frosted, and I know there's a, a million different versions, but if you're one of those people that has a green tree already and you would like to have a flock tree, but maybe you bought it last year, we're gonna show you how to deal with that um, by just buying some flock stems and adding those into your tree. So we're gonna take the flock stem and we're going to push it fairly deep back in the tree and use a piece of your tree that already exists and wrap it around that so it doesn't go anywhere and we're just going to layer this up with two or three different kinds of flocked pine it's going to give us kind of a medium flock look so that the entire thing's not completely covered in snow but you're still going to get a more white base adding pieces of flocked picks would make this tree look so different and you're adding even more yeah so I'm gonna add a couple of different kinds this is a longer branch and that really gives us a little more space out from the tree it also gives us something to hang some more ornaments from and then I'm gonna use some of the in-between spaces and I'm gonna go in with this uh, smaller pick that's a little less expensive so really we've got six of these spread throughout the tree and then we're going to fill in the gaps with a, a less expensive clock pig. Nice! flock picks to our evergreen tree to give it a flocked appearance. Now it's ready for all of your ornaments. Thanks for watching!